where do we start with a game like this? What do you think? <laughs> I don't know. You know, it's kind of a – you talk about a team effort. Yeah. I thought – with the way the wind was today and then how it shifted and it was like in our face for like seemed like every quarter um that factors in on special teams and um you know the stops we made on defense and you know just being able to go hey it's third and four do we want to let them make them burn timeouts or do we want to go for the score and you know going for the score is an aggressive move but i loved it and Man, it's just fun to get yeah, out of here. Absolutely. Absolutely. Four picks today for your Bulldogs secondary, too. They they were flying all over the place. The defense as a whole, I mean, everybody was, I think, playing very, very well. And you held a, a very good, you know, Northwestern offense to, to in check here. They had under 250 yards. How about that defense today and, and getting all those turnovers? You know, I'm just really proud of them because they've uh, – <laughs> It's such a team effort. Yeah. You know, the, the reason that, that we got the picks was because the D-line was just pressuring yep. their quarterback before. And so we were able to play more guys in coverage. And um, and then we made the picks when they were there to be made. We haven't always done that. And so uh, just really encouraging to see that. Really encouraging to think about what we've been through so far this season um, to add a number two. Uh, a win against a number two team on the road is a great playoff resume. And, um, and so now we go into the bye week. With, yeah. with some big things ahead of us, and we're really excited. Absolutely. What was, um, I mean, were the guys just dialed in all, all week? I mean, they're always dialed in for games like this, but was there, was there something something different? You, you see this coming uh, throughout the week? I felt like the best week of practice we had all season was against Dort, and this week of practice was not better than that week. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> we just, um, we had things go our way today because we forced them to go our way. Our, our players made plays in big moments, and big players make big plays in big games. This is a big game for us, and um, to go do it on the road, you know, in an environment where, you know, that we I don't I don't know the last time we won up here. I've been two thousand two, two thousand two here. Been, it's been too long. Two thousand sixteen since the last win over the Red Raiders, right? So, so we're really excited about what happened today. Excited about the outcome. More excited about the locker room and how they handled the loss last week, and um, just proud of our guys. How was that locker room down there? It is probably pretty fun for the guys, right? That was as much fun as I think I've had in a post-game locker room in a while. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Singing the doxology is always more fun after a win. Uh, It it happens either way, but, um, yeah, that was a lively group. We're pumped up here, Coach. I know you are as well. Any final thoughts here from Orange City, Iowa today? No, I'm just proud to be a a part of Bulldog Nation and um, very excited for our players and our alums who um, there's a lot of guys who graduated last year who I wish they could, you know, and two years ago and, 18 years ago that I wish could be a part of this today. Um, and they all are in, in their own way. And it's just a lot of fun to see it come together. 100% coach. Thanks a lot. This will do it for our broadcast today. Thanks everybody for joining in. Talk to you on a couple weeks in Creed. This has been Bulldog Football.